So what we're gonna start, these first couple is kind of dynamic, so we're gonna do them for 30 seconds at a time. So we're gonna start just swinging it. So swinging our arms back and forth 30 seconds, okay? Top arm over, bottom arm up, and you're alternating. Squeeze the shoulder blades as you come back. Good, so you'll do that for 30 seconds, and then you'll go into our vertical swings. Some people call them bushwhackers. We got the horizontal and the vertical swing. Same thing, guys. Alternating, alternating. So you'll get in there for 30 seconds. Okay, next thing I wanna look at is we're gonna go arm circles. So, small arm circles forward. 30 seconds here before you go to medium, okay? Then we'll go to medium arm circles. Same thing, 30 seconds there. And 30 seconds, large arm circles. Good. And next, guys, we'll go in reverse. So reverse, small arm circles. Reverse, medium circles. And reverse, large circles. Good. One more time through, guys. Palms up. 30 second forward. 30 second medium. 30 second large. Then alternate. 30 seconds reverse. 30 seconds medium. 30 seconds large. Good, so you can kind of shake it out in between sets. Your shoulder's gonna get tired. We went through this when I came up there, they're gonna get a little tired, so we gotta condition those shoulders. Okay, next we wanna look at seesaws. So that's with palms down to the ground. To start, we're gonna do three different groups, palms down, palms neutral, and arms kind of pronated, okay? So you'll start here on top. Seesaws, we're going fast, in and out, in and out. Pinching the shoulder blades, let them come forward. Pinch, come forward. 30 seconds there, switch to the curveball grip. Good, palm up grip. Good. You'll shake it out. So you're doing 30 second sets to each grip. So here, here, and here, okay? Next we're gonna look at, it's kind of like your back and forth, so your DJs is what I call them. In and out, in and out. So, palms up, switching, 30 seconds. Then we'll switch, neutral, 30 seconds. On the sky, 30 seconds. Good, so you have your seesaws, which is the in and out, the DJs, which is the shifting over each other, okay? Next one I wanna go to, that's kind of like a modified dynamic. If you go to our website, we have a full advanced dynamic warm-up. You can run through all that, but these are my favorite ones I like to give as a warm-up for my throwers. So I'm gonna go into just kind of three quick stretches that we can do after our dynamic warm-up that I like. So first one, just arm across the body. Use left hand to pull if you're a righty. Right arm if you're a lefty. Hold for one minute. I want every stretch held for at least one minute, okay? To apply that max benefit to that posterior capsule. Good. Next one, arm behind the head. Other arm comes in to pull, and you can use the back of your head to kind of push that elbow back. Feel that stretch kind of run through here. Good, and our last one is gonna be a sleeper stretch. So you can kind of find any place on the ground here. Throwing side 90 degrees. Opposite arm. Working on that arm that's with the ground. Trying to press that hand into the ground. Cheating is if you see that shoulder lift up. I don't want to see the shoulder lift up. I want that sucker glued to the ground. So that's a quick shoulder dynamic with static warm-up. Thanks, guys.